Chapter 5, The Body, The Manifestation of Thought The body is the canvas upon which the mind, heart, soul, and spirit paint their reality. The body, often seen as separate from our inner world, is actually the physical manifestation of all that we are on the inside. Every thought, emotion, and belief eventually finds its way into our physical being, influencing our actions, health, and the way we interact with the world. In many ways, the body is the final product the result of the inner workings of our spirit, mind, heart, and soul. In this chapter, we will explore how the body follows the mind and spirit, acting as the vessel through which our thoughts, beliefs, and emotions are expressed. Understanding the relationship between the body and the inner self is essential to mastering the process of manifestation. When the body is in harmony with our internal alignment, it becomes a powerful tool for bringing our intentions into reality. The body follows thought. We often think of our bodies as something separate from our inner experiences, but the truth is they are deeply interconnected. The thoughts we think, the emotions we feel, and the beliefs we hold all have a direct impact on our physical state. If I believe I am powerless or incapable, my body will reflect that belief. My posture will slump, my energy will drain, and I will move through the world with hesitation. On the other hand, when I believe in my strength and purpose, my body responds accordingly. My posture straightens, I move with confidence, and I feel more energized and alive. This is not just a matter of willpower, it is the natural result of the mind-body connection. Consider how stress affects the body. When we experience mental or emotional stress, our body responds by releasing cortisol and adrenaline, triggering the fight or flight response. Over time, prolonged stress can lead to physical symptoms such as tension, fatigue, and illness. This is just one example of how our thoughts and emotions manifest in our physical being. The power of alignment, when our thoughts, emotions, and beliefs are in alignment, the body becomes an instrument of manifestation. It acts as the final stage of creation, carrying out the actions that bring our inner intentions to life. But when we are out of alignment when our mind says one thing, our heart feels another, and our soul is conflicted, the body experiences confusion and resistance. I remember a time in my life when I was deeply out of alignment. I had big dreams and desires, but my thoughts were filled with doubt, and my emotions were clouded by fear. I would make plans to take action, but my body resisted. I felt sluggish, unmotivated, and often physically tired. It wasn't until I began addressing my inner conflicts facing my doubts and fears head-on that my body started to cooperate with my desires.